guys, Steve Backman here from Chevrolet Buick GMC and Today we're going to talk about the Carbon Pro Denali and the Carbon Pro AT4. Okay, so first thing you're going to notice is on the Denali, it's all chrome, right? And it's the traditional honeycomb grille. When you come over to the AT4, you get a black chrome grille and then a black seal with red tail hooks down below. Now come and check out the wheels. This is a big part of these. So on a Denali Carbon Pro, you're going to get the high gloss 22s. If you come to the AT4, you get either this 18 inch machine with the Goodyear Wrangler Duratrac or a nice 20 inch wheel. Okay, so next we're going to talk about the boxes. Now what's unique to the Carbon Pro on the AT4 and the Denali is they have a carbon fiber box. So unique to the AT4, it's still going to have the multi-pro tailgate. You're going to have black exhaust tips so it gives you that sporty look. And then of course, multi-pro like I talked about but carbon fiber bed. This is the first in its class. On the Denali, we're still going to have the carbon fiber bed. You're just going to trade out the black exhaust tip for some pro ones. Okay, so on the carbon pro box, you have some really cool features on this thing. As I mentioned earlier, this is stronger and lighter than our traditional high strength steel bed, right? So shared with the high strength steel bed, you're going to get the 400 watt inverter, bed LED lighting, Something that I really like about this new bed design is they push these walls out so there's less gap between the outside of the truck and the inside of the bed. So this 5 foot 8 box, our short box, actually has more interior volume than most standard 6.5 foot boxes on the market. Okay, so next we're going to talk about the multi-pro audio system. This is classic system, right? We have the 6-way tailgate and a lot of people don't realize you have this kicker sound system down here that you can run right off your phone. So you just pair Bluetooth, watch this. So you're out the game, hanging out with your buddies, you wanna put on some nice music, go to your phone here. So on either one of these trucks, whether you go the AT4 or the Denali, you can go with the 6.2 liter or the three liter diesel. We just happen to have the three liter diesel in our Denali and the 6.2 liter in the AT4. So this is our workhorse 6.2 liter V8. As you all know, this produces 420 horsepower and 460 foot-pounds of torque. So here's our all-new Duramax diesel 3 liter. This also produces 460 foot-pounds of torque and 277 horsepower. Both of these trucks are mated to a 10-speed transmission. So now we're going to compare the suspension of both trucks. On the AT4, as you can see, it sits up a little bit higher. So the AT4 gives you a factory two inch lift, while the Denali gives you the adaptive ride control. Okay guys, so let's take a look inside the AT4. So unique to the AT4 is the black leather interior with the Kalahari accents. And then take a look at this, you have carbon fiber wood grain trim. So this truck is equipped with a class leading 15 inch heads up display. So what that is, is that's a hologram that's projected on the windshield. So both of these trucks come with a really cool storage compartment your kids are going to love or maybe even yourself. Check this out. So on top of that, this truck has class leading leg room and head room in the rear. I'm about 6'3". I have tons of room up, up top and plenty of leg room in the back. Okay, so unique to Denali is our three-way power step. Check this out. Tap it on the back. The thing comes out. You can easily step up. Grab your cargo from the back of the bed, get it back down, hit it one more time, and it folds back in. So on the inside, this is almost identical to the AT4, other than you get a unique wood grain trim, and then you lose the Kalahari accents, but you're still going to retain all the same technology features on the inside, including adaptive cruise control.